Happening tonight, a rivalry on the hardwood as the Lady Lumberjacks of Arthur Hill get set to take on the Saginaw High Lady Trojans. And TV5's Jason Fielder joins us live from Saginaw High with a preview of tonight's rival game. Jason. David and Elise, it really doesn't get much better than the Hill versus the High, the oldest high school rivalry in the state of Michigan. This is actually round two between the girls' teams this season. Round one taken by Saginaw High last month, 59 to 40. Lady Trojans come into the game with a record of 9 and 8. Lady Lumberjacks come into tonight's contest with a record of 4 and 11. JV game just underway behind us, and the varsity game will follow. And leading the way for the Lady Trojans for that varsity game is the legendary head coach, Annette Baber. I have to. One of the best basketball players to ever come out of Saginaw right here, Coach Babers. Uh, tell us about your team, 9-8, and eight, as you head into the big rivalry game and as you get ready for districts. Wow. It's like this is a dream team for us because last year I lost, I think, six or seven seniors. So we were just like, we're going to dig in like we always do. But this rivalry right here is what we, it's just what Saginaw, it's what Trojans live for. Saginaw High, Arthur Hill, it's, it's been like that since I was a little girl. It's like as a little girl, we always say, I'm going to Saginaw High, I'm going to Saginaw High. But this team, they know what they know, they do what they do, but grind, that's, that's what they do. They, they grind. And when, when we got Kamari Forrest coming to us from Texas, Texas it was like a blessing. She's like, she's my little cousin, and she's won a state championship. I've won a state championship. So we know how it feels to win a state championship, and now she's pouring it into Sharon, and Sharon is pouring it into this team, and I'm ready. Speaking of the rivalry, it's been a big part of your life, mm -hmm. and, um, boy, everybody in this area coming to an end in a couple of years when the, when the schools merge. Your thoughts on that happening, and, and what does the Hill versus the High mean to you? Right now, seeing as though we're still separate, it means everything to me. Because, like, I grew up that we couldn't lose to Arthur Hill. But once they merge, I'll be fine with that because I, I work at Thompson. So all the kids that go to Arthur Hill come through me first. So it's not like the love isn't there. It's just the school rivalry. So once they merge, I'll be ready for it. And the football team has already done it. Saginaw United, great name. You like the name. Thought, thoughts on maybe a, a mascot? Or the school nickname? Trojans. <laughs> I, have to, I mean, I'm just going to be honest, you know, because my thought is we're in the city of Saginaw. It's going to be Saginaw it's High School, but, you know, why not name it Saginaw High School? Every city has a high school in that city. So maybe it won't happen. Maybe it will. I'm praying for it. If it doesn't, oh, well. I know you're biased, right? Yeah, I understand. Good luck tonight. Thank you for joining us. Thank you. Thanks for having me. All right. The legendary head coach and player, Saginaw Highs, Annette Babers. We'll have highlights from tonight's game coming up tonight in the TV5 Sports at 11. All right. Looking forward to it. Thanks, Jason. And while the girls are going head-to-head -to -head tonight, the Lumberjack and Trojan boys teams will play tomorrow afternoon inside Arthur Hill at 1.